We use it all the time. Plastic packaging for pills, plans and groceries. But these products are special. Because instead of polluting the seas, they come from the sea. Lobster shells are the main ingredient for this alternative to conventional plastic. A London-based startup called The Shell Works wants to replace unsustainable materials with environmentally friendly ones. The startup sees potential in seafood waste. Um, we identified within that that actually seafood waste is something that's not being looked at, but within crustacean shells there's a really valuable biopolymer called chitin. Um, so we sought to kind of extract this chitin from the shells and see whether we could find an alternative to single-use plastics. To do this, the team crushes the lobster shells and extracts the chitin. Adding a little bit of household vinegar forms a dense liquid, which can then be shaped into the desired form, like a plastic bag. It's antifungal and antibacterial, which means that it would be really interesting for storing foods. And at the end of life, it's actually a non-polluting fertilizer. So even if you had a bag at home, you could just chop it up, throw it into your plant pots, and it would just help them grow. That would mean less plastic polluting the environment. But is this alternative viable on a large scale? The Shellwork team says yes. At least in cities, lobster shells are readily available as food waste from big restaurants. We've been trying to understand how we could scale this and we reached out to one uh, lobster chain within London and what we found is they actually have 375 tonnes of lobsters going to waste every year, which means chitin content wise that's 125,000 kilograms and um, from that every year we could make about 7.5 million plastic bags. Lobster shells alone won't be able to replace the plastic we use every day, but they could be a piece of the puzzle of creating a more sustainable product cycle. Markus Meyer-Gielen for VOA News, Washington.